Hey, what's happening everybody on this one? I want to show you how to customize your lock screen shortcuts on your Pixel 8. Let's jump into this. So scroll down like this, go to your settings. Now you're going to scroll down to display. You're going to come here to lock screen. Now I'm sure, I'm sure by now a lot of you noticed like when you first get your Pixel, there's nothing there on the lock screen. There's just It's just there, right? So what you're going to do, you're going to fix that. So you're going to come over here and you're going to come to shortcuts. Tap on shortcuts. And if you're like me, when you first got your pixel, there was nothing there. It was blank. So what I like to do on the top, on the bottom left, I put the flashlight. Boom. That's all you got to do, right? You come over here to your right shortcut and you have, look, you can pick from all these right here. This is actually pretty cool. You can pick a uh, video camera, QR code, uh, you can mute something. I'm not really sure what that's about. I think that's muting your sounds on your phone. You can actually go to your Google Home app, which is really cool. Flashlight, like you just see me. Or you can enable Do Not Disturb, which is always important. Or bam, camera. I prefer to do that. So over here on the left, once again, I'm using my flashlight. And then I'm doing that. So that's how you did it. So hopefully y'all were following me there. This is really, really cool. I like having this functionality on the lock screen. So we'll come over here like this. Bam. Now I'll tap over here like that. Boom. Now you can see it, right? You see the flashlight and you see the camera. So I press and hold on the flashlight. Bam. Press and hold again. Off. So we're good to go there. So anyway, there's lots of, and there's tons of different customizations, tons of, tons of features in Android 14. Uh, Android has really grown up quite a bit. It's not like the Android of like old where it was kind of just like whatever. It's actually very, very, very stable. Uh, and like I said, there's lots of customizations. There's lots of things you can do with your lock screens. I will make more videos talking about that. But anyway, I appreciate all of you watching this video. Subscribe, like, do all that stuff. And I will catch all of you in the next one. Take care.